Hello my dear students and welcome to this special session. At this moment, I am with you to tell you about a very, very important announcement. I do believe that you already know this particular announcement because this has been the most awaited and even the dreaded announcement by Medical Council of India. Now this is the announcement about the counseling session of the various seats in the MBBS colleges. So not to waste your time, let us talk about what exactly is the counseling and what exactly is the schedule. So let's see what exactly is the schedule. Now this is the tentative schedule for the online counseling that is the allotment process for the NEET UG, MBBS, BDS, BSc Nursing, all these courses right here for 2023. Now this is all India 2015% quota and uh, now this 15% quota now what does it mean? The entire seats of a medical college they are divided in two parts that is 15% for the all India quota that are any students of any state board or any place in India can take admission through this particular quota. And then there is an 85% quota which is reserved for the students having the domicile of that particular state. So that's what we have as the All India Quota. Now here we have the verification of the tentative seat matrix by participating institute and NMC. That has already been done. Okay, That's going to be from 20th July to 2023 to 21st July 2023. They are going to verify it and then from 20th July to 25th July up to 12 noon, you have to submit your application. You have to get yourself registered on the website so that you may be considered for counseling. So this is going to be, you are going to fill up the course. You are, the course is going to be locked up between 22nd July to 26th July. You have to fill up the course. Actually, you have to start your registration and payment by 20th of July. 25th of July is the last date for that and 26th of July you have to finalize your seat. That is you have to finalize your choice. The allotment of the seat will be on 27th and 28th July and uh, result will be declared on 29th July. So 29th July it will be declared and then you have to upload the documents. Please remember all the documents that you have been told you have to have it ready by then. Already we have the date today is 14th. You already have six days to accumulate all the documents that you require and that documents would require all your caste certificate, the reserved category certificate, the category certificates and your uh, so the various other certificate, the educational certificates that is 10th class certificate, 12th class certificate, all these certificates which have been required, which have been given in your prospectus, those certificates you have to arrange by 20th of July. In fact, 25th of July could be the date, but still I would suggest you start collecting them from today itself. So, this result 29 July, you have to upload the documents by the MCC portal on by 30th July. 31st July to 4th June, August, you have to join the course. So, join the course on 4th of August. So, these counseling sessions, these uh, the registration seat allotment 27 to 28 July, these are going to be the counseling sessions where you will be called depending on what your rankings are. And then, this data, verification of joint candidates, data by institute, sharing of data by MCC would be done on from 5th August to 6th August. Now this is for the first round. That is for the first round, the students who have been called for the first round. Then the second round, the same thing are going to take place in the second round as well, but that is going to start from 7th August. That is the seats which are left in the first round, those are going to be carried forward in the second round. Is that clear? So this is what we have a second counseling here. Again, the same process is going to take place and that counseling date is going to end off at 30th August. So by 30th August, the second counseling date would be over. But remember, your course would start in August itself. If certain other seats are left, then in that case, this is going to be round three. This is going to be for the All India Quota, Deemed Universities, Central Universities, MBBS, BDS 
and here it is second round for the first round is for all India quota again that is same thing is going to take place. Now this is going to start from 1st of September 31st of August and that is going to end on 20th of September. So this is all depending on your ranks which the schedule it's going to be. It's not necessary that the, the schedule has to go up to round 3 and then this is going to be the stray vacancy round which is also termed as the mop up round where you might there might be certain vacancies which could be because of certain students leaving the seats and uh, certain students not able to join or they got a better opportunity so these are the mop up rounds these are the seats which just pop up to be vacant now this is pure luck they call up i believe you have given the same uh, phone number as the phone number that you were having at that time so you would have given the same phone number in the counseling as well as the application form so that the teacher the people can contact you to join here so this is going to be the stray vacancy round or the mop up round and this is going to end at 30th of september so by 30th of september entire fate of all the students who are appearing for all the entrance all the medical seats whether it be bds whether it be bsc nursing whether it be mbbs the fate would be sealed by 30th of september so that's the information that you have so i would suggest sincerely suggest that you start collecting all your forms all your question paper all the things that you might be requiring and prepare for it any other doubts today i'm not able to see your questions So that's what we have. So that has not been seen clear. So we are going to finish it off. So anybody who wants to ask anything, they can ask in the comment section. Till then, bye-bye.